All right, all right. Welcome in, everybody. Hey, it's time for another daily Japanese study video. It is 10.13 p.m. here on the East Coast of the United States. I'm tired, so we're going to get right into it. I'm going to go over by Mama Maria, which is my favorite place to uh, hang out, Mama Maria. Uh, and let's crouch down and get right into it. Normally, there's a lot of preamble and uh, bloviating as I talk and yip and yawn here. Uh, but instead, we're just going to get right into it with say Niku Ten. Right here, say Niku Ten. Niku is flesh, our meat. Uh, and here, we see uh, Ushiyama say Niku Ten. Uh, uh, Ushi is uh, cow, Yama is mountain, and say Niku Ten is butcher shop. So this is cow mountain butcher shop. Uh, here we have Hanasu, which totally makes sense for a butcher shop. It's not a word that they just had to fit in somewhere. Surely not. It's Shinsen. 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 And Kiru. So, uh, we have two verbs here, Hanasu and Kiru. And we also have Shinsen, which you can use as an adjective to describe something. Maybe even Niku, meat. Uh, shinsen na Niku. Uh, would be fresh meat. So let's go ahead and get fresh on there. Uh, hopping up to Hanasu, the reason I give this uh, one uh, so much gaff, so much lip, so much chin music is because what does to speak have to do with a butcher shop? More than any other store. Like the ramen ya, you Hanasu there. The honya, you Hanasu there. Densha. Hanasu, Panya, Hanasu. You talk at all of them. You speak at all of them. Why don't uh, it's it's a weird one to see here. Uh, kiru is what uh, the butcher will do to the niku. So niku o kitemasu. I'm cutting the meat. Kitemasu, kiru. So kiru. We're gonna drop the ru at mas kimas to say that we are cutting the meat. Uh, we can also drop the ru and add te. Imas to say we are currently doing the cutting. So niku o kitemas shinsen na niku o kitemas. I'm cutting the fresh meat, which is a bit weird to say. Sure. All right. Good, good, good. Foodboru, foodboru, food bowl. It's 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 a food bowl for pets. Uh, in this case, uh, we're looking at uh, what. Ben? Is that Ben? Okay, yeah, sure. Uh, kitanai is a adjective that could describe a food deboru. Sure, surely. Uh, aku is the word that all pets will always describe their food bowl at all times. Definitely. Uh, and it is a verb uh, to be something. And then we have ipai here which is a descriptor as well to describe the food bowl. Uh, when your pet says, uh, food bowl o aitemas, uh, they're saying the food bowl is empty. It's currently empty. Uh, it's probably actually bite, which is full, a lot, many. So let's go ahead and match these up to be empty. And then keep an eye up here, you probably saw, is dirty like a right-wing streamer's bedroom it is kitanai uh, all right so we have aku which is to be empty we have ipai full a lot many uh, you might hear ipai in a different context uh, i went out drinking many a time in japan and i heard moipai more than a few times and it means one more uh, so i hear uh, it's a it's a counter for but in this case we're using it to mean full a lot many so a full food boru would be ippai food boru o uh akanai akanai because uh, the full food bowl is not empty so aku is a golden verb so we take the ku switch it to ka so that's akanai to mean a negative right there. So, ippai food boru o akanai. All right, let's go ahead. Get that checked. All right. Here we have 
passport, passport. We have motsu, we have taisetsu, and then roko niku. So roko means travel, not to travel, just travel. So roko niku. We're taking iku, which means to go, and attaching it to roko via the ni particle. We're saying to travel, to vacation, to roko ni iku. Ah, etto sugiharu wa nihon o roko ni ikimashi. I am going to travel to Japan on the next spring. So. Uh, coming up in spring, I am traveling to Japan. It will be fun. Uh, here we have motsu, which means to hold. Uh, if you want to ask if somebody has something on them, like let's say uh, you go to sign something, your your pen ran out of ink. You will turn to somebody and say, "Ah, uh, pen." So pen, and then o is hey. Uh, the verb that we're about to describe onto pen. So pen o. Uh, so, motsu, if you want to put it into the currently holding something, will be motemas, motemas. So that tsu is going to become a small tsu, te, for te form. So, motte, motte. And then we add iru, conjugate it to imas. So, motemas. Uh, and so you can say, ah, sumimasen, pen no motemas. Uh, excuse me, do you have a pen? Is what you're be uh, saying there. Sumimasen, pen no motemasu. Anytime you say motemas, you are saying that, uh, hey, do you currently have something? And, uh, you know, maybe uh, a uh, police officer, uh, what is that, keisetsu? Keisetsu? Let's double check that. Let, let's break out the phone and double check that. I believe it's keisetsu, but it's not a word that I use very regularly. Uh, so let's double check it here as I get out uh, Takoboto, uh, which is the offline one. Police is, uh, <clears throat> yes, Keisatsu, not Keisetsu. Close, close, Keisatsu. So uh, the Keisatsu might approach you and be like, uh, and see that you are distinctly lacking in the melanin department. Uh, and they might say, ah. Uh, uh, are you currently holding a... Do you currently have your passport? Do you have your passport? Is what that would be saying. And then down here, Taisetsu is important. So let's go ahead and get that matched up. Uh, my passport is rather important. At least to me. Alright. Uh, nuigurumi, nuigurumi. Uh, oh, speaking of uh, gurumi, kurumi is walnut, I, I, I believe. I was looking it up the other day because as I'm walking, I see walnuts fairly regularly. Uh, so, uh, kurumi. And then I also learned that uh, kuribo uh, is... Uh, uh, not only the uh, Japanese word for Goomba, uh, but it means chestnut, which is kind of neat to find out as well. Uh, Nuigurumi is a plushie. Uh, here we have uh, Tamogozashi is what it looks like. Uh, all right, so what do we have for our words here? We have, <clears throat> let's start from the bottom and go up. Fua fua, uh, by the fact that it says Sound, sound, we know that it is a onomatopoeia. That's the only time you see that. Not all onomatopoeias are like that, but if you do see that, it's an onomatopoeia. Uh, fua, fua, kare, kare, uh, gichi, gichi, uh, pizza, pizza, uh, pika, pika. Any of those are all onomatopoeias. Uh, this onomatopoeia is describing a nui gurumi. Uh, uh, a lot of plush toys are fluffy, is what fua fua means. <clears throat> and now up here we have ageru. Ageru is a verb. And then up here, dakishimeru. Dakishimeru. 
So both of these are verbs right here. Both end in do, a geru, eru, and then a dakshimeru. So both of these are ichidan verbs. Uh, what that means is if we want to conjugate them into their polite form, we're going to drop that ru and add mas to them. So dakshimemas, dakshimemas, and agemas. Uh, fun fact, agemas here means to give. Uh, that's not the fun fact. The fun fact part is if you take this verb and you attach it to the te form of other verbs, it means you are giving the verb to someone, to something. You're doing the verb for the sake of someone else. Um, so we had motsu earlier, to hold. Motteru is holding. Motte agemashita is I held it for someone. So, ageru, agemasu, agemashita, put it into the past tense. Uh, and then, motsu, motte, motte agemashita. Uh, I held it for someone. I held it for you, uh, probably, is what you're going to be saying. Uh, if you have not already specified a, a topic prior to that. So, uh, you could say, haha wa. Uh, what, what, what are you holding? What did you hold for your mom? Uh, I, I, I honestly, what do you hold? What do I carry around? Uh, kaban? Uh, haha wa, haha no kaban o, uh, motte agemashita. I held my mother's bag for my mom. Sure, you know. Uh, you could just drop the ha ha wa and just say ha ha no kaban o motte agemashita. I held my mom's back. As and then the assumed subject would be your mom. Uh, Alright, so let's go ahead. Oh, we didn't actually uh, talk about dakshimeru, which I. That's to cuddle, right? To cuddle. Listen, I got it. Alright, so to give and fluffy. And yes, by itself, ageru is to give, but when you attach it to a verb, you're saying, I'm giving verb. So if you want to say that you're uh, giving your, let's use mom again, haha. Haha ni duigurumi o agemashita. I gave my mom a plushie. Uh, let's see, what, what's, uh, what's popular right now? Dandadan just came out, that's popular. So, haha wa, dandadan no nuigurumi o agemashita. I gave my mom a dandadan plushie. Sure, why not? Supa, here we have a supermarket, supa. Uh, let's start from the bottom here. We have ka u, kao, which, uh, <clears throat> Uh, depending on the context and pronunciation and pitch, uh, cow can mean a couple of different things. In this specific example, with that specific uh, kanji, we are talking about what you do with items at supermarkets. So a supermarket is supa, super na, supa mono. Could you say supa mono? So supermarket things. Uh, supa no, uh, kono mono te, oh, ane, hmm. Eh, we'll, we'll hop away from that example, because I, I can't, uh, solidify it in my brain here. Uh, so, uh, aru baito, aru baito. Uh, this is actually a, uh, noun, but if you just have baito, you add suru to it, it becomes a verb that means to do this thing. Uh, and when you are inside a supa, supa no naka ni, uh, I'm sorry, so inside the supermarket, supa no naka ni, niku o, huh, so niku o, so the verb is going to affect niku, so supa no naka ni, niku o, and then we have sagasu right here. Sagasu is to look for, to hunt for, to search for. Sagasu. So su will become shite, 
if we're going to turn into te form. So we want to say we are looking for meat in the supermarket. We could say supa no naka, supa no naka ni uh, niku o saga shite mas, saga shite mas. Uh, if you want to say, let's use ageru from earlier, uh, that you are searching for someone on behalf of someone, you could say saga shite agemas, saga shite agemas. Uh, I am searching for you. Ah, uh, no kagi o sagashite an, sagashite agemas, sagashite agemas. Uh, so kagi is keys. Uh, so ka, uh, no kagi, your keys. Anata no kagi o uh, sagashite agemas, sagashite agemas. All right, let's go ahead and get matched up here. Oh, I didn't actually say what this was. Uh, Arubaito is part-time job. Uh, baito suru is to work a part-time job. Kao is to buy things. So, uh, kao is a gold-on verb. The same with sagasu up there, which means we can take that u sound and move it up and down the, the actual uh, conjugation letter there to a, i, u, e, o. And uh, any of those will have an additional meaning to it. Uh, so, Sagasu, uh, saga, she puts it into the noun form, and then if we add mas, that turns it back into a verb, but uh, politely conjugated. So sagashimasu, sagashimasu. Uh, if we turn it into the a form, uh, sagasa nai, we don't do it. Turn it into the o form, then we get sagaso which means let's look for it to get. So like I'm saying, hey, let's look for something. Niko uh, sagaso. Let, let's look for meat. Okay. Uh, but then the e uh, is a base that you can add. Uh, what is it? Rareu uh, to uh, to mean that you are able to do the thing. So sagaserareu. Uh, I believe would mean uh, I am able to look for something. Arereu, uh, eru on there, so I'm going to make an assumption. I've only seen it as rareru, but I'm assuming I can take that ru, drop it in at mashta, mas or masen on there, or conjugate it however I would a ru verb. Uh, if you want to say that you want to be able to look for something, could you say, and this is going to be weird here, so, sagase ra re tai. Sagase ra re re tai. Sagase ra re tai. Would that mean I want to be able to look for something? That's a, whew, that's a lot to work through right there, huh? All right, let's uh, let's leave that one hanging and keep moving on here. Oh, did I accidentally? I accidentally moved on it. That's okay. That's neither here nor there. All right. Well, with that, we are now 18 minutes into the video. Let's see what we have uh, for Anki here. Go to our decks. Uh, not that much, actually. Let's go down to Nihongo no Kotoba, which is this deck down here. So Nihongo. No kotoba. Uh, so this says Japanese words. Uh, so we have 15 new words, 19 to review. Let's see what we get here. Let's move it really big on here. Ah, uh, sekiyu. 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 Oil. Sekiyu. Uh, <clears throat> so this right here means oil. This right here means stone. So oil from a stone. That, that's like petrol, uh, oil, yes. All right, uh, here we have keiki, cake, cake, easy, okay. Ah, okay, here we have uh, shi with dakotan becomes ji, with ya lil becomes ja, ga imo, jiga imo, potato, jiga imo is potato which I need to get uh, better at. Also, 
I have heard plenty of Japanese just say, ah, uh, potato fryu, to mean like fried potatoes, like French fries and stuff. So don't think that you won't hear potato, because all of those are sounds you can make in Japanese as well. Ah, uh, ooh, ah, uh, yaita, yaita. This is a uh, fried, baked. Yes, bait. So this is uh, the ya from yaku. So yakimas, yakimashita, fried, I will fry, I will bake, I will broil, I will basically everything but boil, <laughs> it seems. So baked. Uh, ude is arms. Boku no ude wa tsuyoi da yo. Arm. Yeah, good. Uh, chichi is a way of saying father. But it's also a way of saying just like generic milk, chichi. Uh, so this plus gyu was gyu nyu, which is uh, cow milk, or as we call it, milk. Uh, speaking of, here we have, uh, so ki becomes gi with you, gyu niku. So we have cow right here and flesh. So cow flesh, what is cow flesh? Well, uh, cow flesh is, well, it's, it's, it's beef, it's beef. So let's, let's click on that, beef. Gyuniku, gyuniku, I'm gonna say easy because that's one that I already knew pretty well. Uh, sake, sake is a way of saying a type of salmon. Salmon, salmon, good. Ah. Uh, uh, ooh, how would you, how would you say smoked? Uh. All right, so here we have cow, here we have milk, gyu nyu is what we're looking at, gyu nyu, uh, cow milk. I didn't bother to put the hiragana here, but you'll have to trust me that gyu nyu is how you would say that. Uh, ido, ido, this is a well door. I think this is like literally just a water well. Yes, okay. Ido. Soup. This is soup. This is soup. Hey, that's soup. Jōniku. Uh, Mutton. Jōuniku. So we have sheep. We have flesh. That's mutton. Uh, apparently, you might also sometimes hear maton. Ma u ton. Uh, but yōniku as well. Yo niku. Good. Okay. Uh, here we have arau. 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 To... No. No, that's karau. Warau is to laugh. What is arau? Arau, to wash. Okay, so this is wash. We have the water radical here. Yeah, fair enough. Okay, again. Ah, tori, dori. Uh, this right here is a road. Typically paved, but not always road. You might also hear doru. And uh, so dori, tori is going to be a path that you walk upon. All right, good. Uh, kuki, ku, and then a small uh, tsu means you hold that, uh, and then go e, kuki, kuki. This is kuki. It's a cookie. Cookie. Ah, uh, boku wa kuki ga suki da. Yeah, 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 yeah. Daisuki da. I, I like cookies. No, I love cookies. Okay, cookie. Ah, ogawa. Ogawa. So this is small. This is river. What's a small river but a stream? A brook. Wonderful. Ah, ah, to. This is uh, grapes. Grapes, right? So we have f becomes uh, budo. Budo, right? Grapes. Yeah, budo. Good, 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 good. Hey, arau to wash. Arau, good. Uh, coca, coco. Yeah. All right. 
uh, here we have he becomes b be, bean bowl bean bowl is poor bean bowl which is fun to say definitely uh she chu she chu oh this was stew right yes yes she chu she chu stew to takusan she chu wa totemo oishi desu yo i'm i'm just saying a lot of stews are very delicious uh, all right who ko right do you remember this one this is this is one that is definitely a review word right here ko ra i ko rai i wonder if folks can remember this one right here ko rai is ancient ancient so ko rai not like well pe past furui uh we are into ko rai which is ancient uh so the ancient uh what what should we tell the ancient dragon there we go uh koroi korai riru korai riru the ancient dragon korai akai ah uh, actually if we want to say the ancient red dragon uh like like that guy right 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 there yes i d and d uh we would take korai and we take drop the e and add kute karakute karakute akai ryu karakute akai ryu karakute akai ryu that is the ancient red dragon all right good 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 uh pai pa e pai it it's pai good 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 Tabun. Uh, probably. Tabun. Good. Okay. Uh, uh, he becomes B becomes P. So, P. Kurus. Pickles. P. Kurus. Pickles. P. Kurus. It's kind of fun to say. P. Kurus. Pickles. All right. Uh, Hozoi was uh, thin. Yes, Hozoi. Good, 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 good. Ah, ah, supai, supai. Uh, so, su, and then small tsu means we're gonna hit this, hold it, and go. So, su, and then pa here. So, supa e, supai, supai, sour. Uh, I I realized I didn't say sour beforehand, so we'll we'll hit it with hard, even though. Uh, <laughs> uh, Cream, cream. It's hey, it's cream. We're gonna say easy on that one. Ah, uh, this is oil. Uh, I recognize the kanji more than the word, which is fun. Okay. Uh, so abura, abura, abura. Hato. Uh, let's uh, let's say corn oil. Uh, or you know what? Let's just do, cause you'll you'll see like oil from different grains uh so what was that uh, kokumotsu kokumotsu uh yeah kokumotsu no abura o ryori suru i cook uh actually we should use de on there so we would say uh kokumotsu abura de niku o Ryori shimasu. Ryori shimasu. Uh, so that is saying, uh, with uh, grain oil, I cook meat. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, abura is oil, specifically for cooking, different than the petrol that we saw earlier. Aruba. Not aruba. Not aruba. Abura. Abura, uh, cooking oil. Okay, good, 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 good. Wonderful. Okay, here we have sato. Do you know sato? Ah, uh, let's see. Uh, amai. Sato wa amai desu. Totemo amai desu. Ah, uh, 
一番甘いです。Uh, so, uh, 砂糖、uh, you might have noticed I said 甘い which is sweet. Then I said, とても甘い Very sweet. And then I said, yeah, yeah, yeah. 一番一番 is the most something, the number one of the thing.、Uh, so, sato is of course the most sweet because it's literally sugar. Sato, sugar. Good, good. Mane is beans. I like beans.、Uh, hachimitsu.、Uh, this is honey, hachimitsu. Okay.、Uh, tara. Tara. Is cod, tara. Good. Okay. Bansan, dinner. It's a way of saying dinner.、Uh, ryori is cuisine or cooked food. Good.、Uh, ita. Ah,、uh, yaita. Bait. Good. Yaita. Gyunyu, milk. Good. All right. Chichi, milk. Good.、Uh, okay. Cookie, it's a cookie. Good.、Uh, okay.、Uh, shichu, shichu, stew. Good.、Uh, arau,、uh, arau is to wash. Good.、Uh, Coco. Oh, didn't mean to click on Google there, sorry. Good.、Uh, pie, pie, pie. Good. All right.、Uh, Pickles, pickles, good.、Uh, sugar, sato, sugar.、Uh, hachimitsu, honey. Ah,、uh, sato wa chotto ga ski da. Demo, hachimitsu wa ato dai ski des. I, I kind of like、uh, sugar, but I love honey. All right, let's go ahead.、Uh, Bunsan. Hey, that's dinner. That's a way of saying dinner. All right, good. And I want to point out that、uh, we have not seen all the words that we've added to the deck yet, so there's definitely more to come. We're going to leave it right there, however, because we are now 32 minutes into this video. Thank you so much for watching, by the way. Uh, there is going to be another Minecraft video today.、Uh, it's not necessarily going to be a daily thing. I just had the time for it. So, with that,、uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you tomorrow for the next daily study video.、Uh, I know it sounds like I know what I'm talking about, but listen, I am still learning just the same as you.、Uh, so, if you catch something that you're like, wait a second, I think that's like this, or maybe you're fluent and you just for some reason watched all the way to this. Uh, stage of the video.、Um, and also, I made it to this stage of the video realizing I forgot to hide the bonus stream、uh, counter. Oops, a doodle. Anyways,、uh, I hope to see you at the next video. If I don't, I still hope to see you again real soon. Thank you so much for watching. Itsumo, arigatou gozaimasu. Alright, talk to you later. Bye.